Good morning, good evening everyone, this is Flair and welcome back to another episode of Dungeon of the Endless. Last time, there are a few close shaves as we went through floor 6. Um, for instance, we hit upon a stell that reduced all our defence down to zero. Uh, it gave us a speed boost uh, and an offensive boost to minor modules for heroes not in rooms with monsters. But that didn't quite assail my fears, shall we say. We didn't lose anyone, although it came fairly close a couple of times. But I'm going to try and not do that again. Okay. What I might actually do for a start here this time is actually get down... Hmm. Yeah, I'm actually going to put down the emergency generator there first. So that... Uh, yeah, we'll have Golgi operate that so we can get an increased probability of our dust loot in the floor. And there's an artifact as well, cool. What do we have? Oh, food replicator mark two. Yes, please, I want that. Okay. What's in here? Nice. Empty room. And a major module slot in there. I always try to say minor. Uh, module slot, but it's a major one. Uh, yeah, I think we can leave Elise in there for the moment, just to operate that. And send uh, Tro and Ken over to hit another artifact. Well, that's useful, certainly. Uh, oh, mechanical pal. Yeah, let's grab up that, so then we can free up Golgi from that job there, and bring her forward. Okay. So, there's just another exit to the left here. More dust. There's a food replicator upgrade mark two. Very cool. Yikes. Okay, uh, Ken, quickly go check to see what's up there, would you? Uh, let me see what. Oh. Ah, okay. There we go. Uh, Autodox, prisoner prod. Ooh, take us level two. Yes, I want that. So, what does Elise get for her next level? Another active, which is shrapnelizer. Uh, Ken doesn't get one yet, but he does get a boost to his defense, which would be good. Um, and his DPS as well. Hmm. I think let's level up Ken, so he could do with that. Also, I want to see what his next skill is. Okay, seems good. Right, now we've got uh, Generator Industry Food is next. There you go, just take that down. Uh, what do we want? We probably want to just get some tear gas in here. And a neurostun as well. Just to hinder things that are trying to come at us. Okay, not much. We can power this room at least. Damn crystal. Die already. There we go. What? Whoa, I've just noticed that. There's. Those are prison cells. Yikes. Okay then. Was not expecting that. Well, mechanical power unlocked. Cool. Uh, Ken, would you quickly nip back to this one and see what's going on? Uh, oh, tactical HUD. I'd like that. One more door and we can get that um, unlocked, in fact. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do for the time being. Let's get a science. Science machine going there. Do we have our mechanical pals yet? No. Oh, yes, we do. So we can stick him in there. Golgi, you can move up. And now, at least, you can be part of Team 1. Or, in fact, uh, go to here and operate the food replicator. So we can uh, start leveling people a bit faster. Okay. Oh, nice. There's our tear gas upgrade. Let's go in here and uh, fortify with the lease. Awesome. And get all that repaired as well. Okay. And what's over here further left? Again. Hey! Cut. Shopkeeper. Hello there, sir. So, do you have a zone device, guard uniform, and a sabre? Ooh. Sabre duelist. I can't remember what that one is. I think it's a pretty cool one, but I just can't for the life of me remember. Hmm. Does anybody else use a sword? Uh, 
can use a machine gun. Uh, Golgi just fights with her bare hands. Uh, let's see, uniform, uh, guard uniform, rather. Speed minus one, defense plus nine. Uh, defense 25, health regen 2, and neurostun light. That would be really good for Goldie, I feel. Or Ken, in fact. In fact, either of those two. Golgi, you can kind of handle her own a bit more. But I feel not armor up Ken and Tro here. Cost industry. But that's fairly good, as a matter of fact. Hmm. I just wonder who I should give this piece of armor to. Let's see, whose defense is lower? Ken's, by a minute amount. Whose speed is lower? That would be Tro. That cost us 129 industry. A bit expensive. Let's just buy the zone device and give it to one of them, and we'll save on the guard uniform. Uh, let's give it to Ken. There you go. And so you got your back. Oh, danger junkie. Yeah, that's the one. Uh, attack power plus 12 if alone in the room, and speed as well. Okay. I was just wondering what that uh, skill there was. Oh, we can power this room as well. Hey, dead end. Cool. <laughs> the exit. I have no idea how I do this. No idea, but it always happens. Well, always happens until about floor 9 or 10. Then I actually have to start properly looking for where the... Um, for where the exit is. Otherwise, I just... It just turns up. Okay, what's going on in this room then? Hey, a bit of dust. And a bit of company too. Uh, I think we might need some help here. For Elise. Yeah, she's gonna. Well, first turf mode, go for it. And gold, you can handle that one. Boop. Hey, nice. Well done, everyone. Okay, let's get Lisa next level. Shrapnelizer. Which. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love that little icon. Just. Poof, boom. <laughs> Everything gets destroyed. Hmm. Well, I've got enough to power this room now. That's good. Uh, oh, while we're here. Uh, Tro, can you just see what we have? Oh, yeah. Tactical HUD. Want that. And what's in this one? Uh, ooh, suppressive firebot. Yes, please, I'd like that. And it seems there's another minor module slot in here that I didn't see the first time. So I'd like to... Hmm. I think a dust field gen would be good. Right there. Okay. Uh, oh. Let's quickly... Activate that. And... I got chips. Oh well. Can't be lucky all the time. What's in here then? Okay, no, no, no. Get rid of, get rid of that one. There we go. Do not want that bug flying right to my crystal. That would annoy the hell out of me. No company from the other way. That's good. Uh, hmm. I think it'd be a good idea to power that room down and power this one up, and maybe. Two. Hmm. Don't really have that much to armor ourselves up with. That's why I was a bit um, on the fence about getting that zone device. But yeah, I, they did need armoring. So let's uh, she bolster this room here with the artifact, or with the second artifact. What do we want? <laughs> Just a load of Tesla modules, maybe? That sounds actually completely fine. In which case, I'm actually going to stick a dust field gen in there as well, because that will be safe to retreat to for our heroes. 
and not kill them by having some blasters around. Okay, nothing there. No company, good. Oh, another dead end. Hey, there's a tactical HUD unlocked. Oh, there's company. Yep, there is definitely company. Oh my word. Okay, you two, get your buffs ready. And you two. Buff time, everyone. Oh my god. Trapnelizer. Oh man, Elise, you wonderful lady. Just shrapnelizes them all into oblivion. Admittedly, those now on three room cooldowns, both, which is uh, a little bit frustrating, but. Yeah, well. Had to be done. Because there's no way that anybody else would get there fast enough, apart from Goldie, but she's even more fragile than Elise, and that would be absolutely chaotic. And unproductive if we sent in Golgi there and she died as well. Okay, well, it looks like we've exhausted that little corner. So. Okay, we've got another little intersection here. Another stell. Oh, and it seems like we've got movement speed going. No company, that's good. Yep, just strat up double movement speed. Awesome. Okay, what's in here? Nothing? It's quiet. Good. And here we have... Oh! We've got dust. We've got dust and we've got company. Oh, I should armour up this room quickly. See, Well, if it's possible. Yeah, dust field gen. Suppress the firebot. Autodoc shards and tear gas. Let's see if we can get those built fast enough. Oh, hello! I see you. I see both of you. Oh dear, dear, dear. Um. Okay, Golgi, get over there, please. Actually, no. Um. Can you stay here? Tro, you go after those ones. This is where it's going to get a little bit more hectic. Okay, how's Golgi doing? She just wrecked her face. Good. Uh, Ken? Yes, say no selfish if you would, please. Um, I wonder if there's any way we can drop a heal on him. But we'll see. Okay, yeah, he could do the heal. And now everything seems to be going fine. Oh, uh, yes, Golgi, if you would um, deal with that guy as well, please. And at least you should probably help. Nice! All done. Okay. Uh, Golgi, head back to your industry generator, please, if you would. Uh, everything in here seems still fine. Awesome. Uh, can just quickly go over there and fix up the stuff that got broken. That movement speed still is still there. Good. Okay. So, yeah, we don't have any actual offensive modules in this room, so that's a slight worry. Uh, we don't really have the industry to build anything else either. It probably wouldn't be worth it to build another industry generator because we're getting very close to the end of the floor, I feel. Let's just head on out this way. Not a dead end yet. But we do get an artifact, I think. And no company. Good. Monsters! And, yep, more monsters. Straight incoming. You know what I'm thinking? Hell are you guys! 
can pick that up. Actually, no, wait a second before you do that. Depower all these. Pick that up. And everybody run the hell away. Right now. Right this very second. Run the hell away. Meet me. Now, is there any loot that we're missing? Just a little bit. Just a tiny little bit. What's in here? Last floor can Is it worth it going through all that way with Gold Eater? Just no. It's not worth it. We're leaving. Ah. I haven't killed anything for a few minutes. Feels weird. I guess it kind of does. So, stage time 14 minutes, total time. Um, total time at the moment is uh, an hour and a quarter. Probably longer than that, in fact, because of all the pausing. Hmm. Well, if that's the stage, that probably means it's a good time to end the episode here. Just uh, ending off floor 7. Um, probably might be a bit shorter than normal, but I think it's okay. So, my name's been Flair, this has been Dungeon of the Endless. Uh, if you've liked, enjoyed the episode, please do give it a like. If you haven't, give it a dislike. If that doesn't quite encapsulate things, leave a comment down below. I'd love to read them. And if you enjoy anything else I do on the channel, uh, please subscribe. It'll keep me motivated to keep producing awesome content for you all. <sighs> so, I guess I'll see you all next time on Dungeon of the Endless. Bye, everyone! <laughs>